Right, so children are definitely the future of tomorrow and on this episode we will be acknowledging that and to do that with us is a professional photographer at age eight and has become a household name in the world of photography in Nigeria. Ladies and gentlemen, let's make welcome Arike Moyolua Olua Shem. Welcome to the show. How are you doing? Hi, thank you. And you? I'm well. You How are you? Amazing. Oh, thank Who you. got your dress for you? Who picked it out? Is it you, mommy? Mommy. Do you like what she picked? Yeah, it's beautiful. Oh, it is. Oh, Happy nice. Children's Day to you. Thank you. Okay, mm. so I've seen your gadget. It's really big, almost as big as you. How long have you had this for? A long time. Like 2000 and... You remember? Over five years, let's see. Okay. Yeah? When yeah. did you start touching cameras and Since taking pictures? I was three. Since you were three? What's your favorite thing about taking pictures? My favorite thing about taking pictures? Everything. Everything. Do you edit them yourself? No. Nope. Who edits it for you? My dad. Nice. All right, so what made you pick up the camera? I know it's a, it's a family thing. You saw your dad doing it, you saw your mom doing it, but um, what made you get interested in picking up the camera as a child? Mm, it looks fun. Mm. Mm. You just like a small toy, mm. but you can play with it, and I never knew I'll go this big. Mm, see. <laughs> she is big, okay. So what do your friends think when they see you with a camera? Do they get jealous or do they get like, oh, we're excited and they always want you to take a picture? Yeah. They yeah. always want you to take a picture. So yeah. how much do you charge for a picture? You want to take a picture of me now. How much do you charge? Me? For me, I mostly do free sometimes. Oh. But mm. for my dad. Obviously, your dad won't like that. <laughs> mm. <laughs> so how much does your dad charge? If do you know? Wants to, you don't know. I don't know. What's, what's the best thing you've ever taken? Like, is it a person or a thing? Like, what's the best thing you you took a person. picture of and you loved it? Okay, who's the person? Busy, um, DJ, any money or mm. my family? Oh, the one I took today. The one you took today. Oh. All right. So, okay. if there's anyone or any place in the world that you would like to take a picture of, who would it be or where would it be? I don't really have lots of fans and lot of places I want to go to. Mm -hmm. So, so if I give you a free ticket now, you say no, thank you. You don't yeah. want to travel to Ghana or you like Nigeria? Mm, yes. Okay. All right. So let's talk about the reason why you're here today, and it's of course on Children's Day. Of course. Um, what does Children's Day Children's Day mean to you? Like an happy day for children to leave. Mm -hmm. To be happy, to have their own day. Do you think we should have Children's Day every day? <laughs> <laughs> do you? What do you think? Don't, don't worry, I won't tell Daddy. Nah. It's too much? Yes. Okay, so if you were not taking pictures, what else would you like to do? Hmm. I don't know. Or you, grow up, you would like to model. Do, they, do people take pictures of you? Yeah. Who takes pictures of you? My dad, my mom, my sisters, mm. all the photographers too. Okay. Let's talk about your sister. I know she's like your, well, let's say your personal assistant. What's it like working with family? It's really nice. Very well. With her? Does, yeah. she, does she take orders well? Is she helpful? She's helpful. She's helpful, like you, that did that, you okay. said that with a rolling eyes. Mm -hmm. what, what, is she really helpful? Yeah, she is. Okay. But sometimes. Sometimes she's. Is she also into photography? Does she have interest in it like that? No. Okay. She so that mean... explains that, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> I guess that explains. Okay, that. Let's, let's talk about school. I know that you're not really going to school right now because of COVID. Are you sad about that? Or is it like a relief for you? Yeah, I'm sad about that. It's really mm. sad. You like school? Yeah. Do you like your subjects? Yeah. What's your favorite of all time? Creative. Creative. That's a subject. Obviously. <laughs> like what? Please, I'm, what did they teach you? Creative. I don't know. No, I didn't do creative. CCA. What does that mean? Mm. 
something, some you see, we Creative, we're going to school for a while. Something, something, don't okay. worry, we, we get it. Okay. You don't like math? Mm, I do. Okay. What about science? You do science? Science? I don't know. You don't do science? Okay. I don't do science. All right, so tell us, um, you've, not, you've been at home for a while now. Have you improved yourself while you've been at home in terms of um, your craft? What have you been doing differently mm. that school wouldn't give you the chance to do on the norm? Like, I've seen a lot of things I can do. I've gone researching, mm. okay. looking for pictures to take pictures. Yes. And, oh. mm. Are you learning to edit your pictures yourself as well? Do you want to do that? Yeah, but my dad won't allow me. <laughs> He won't let you, because he just feels you'll be doing it free for everyone. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe that's why. Do you, um, have you been able to play outside? Do you play? Do you like playing or this is play to you? Mm, I like to play. Okay, so have you been playing outside? Do you prefer to play inside or outside? Inside. Oh, inside. So this has not really affected you then? You play with your sister? <laughs> yes. So nice. All okay. right, so let's touch on the reason why you've been at home for a while. What does um, COVID-19 mean to you? What, what, what is the meaning of COVID-19? Hmm. What do you understand by COVID-19? Coronavirus. What is it? Coronavirus. I don't really understand anything about it. You just know that you can't go to school because of this thing. No, but I know it's a disease right. mm -hmm. that can affect everyone, mm -hmm. but we have to be careful. Not to catch it. Yeah. yeah. Alright, so talk to the children out there on the things to do to avoid coronavirus. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What can they do so they don't catch it? Always wash your hands. Okay. Mm -hmm. Use your sanitizer. Right. Mm -hmm. Don't touch anybody. Mm -hmm. And I'll basically, you, you've got it right. Yeah, don't touch your good. don't touch your eyes, your nose, and your mouth. That's good. Well done. Yeah. So have you been doing all those things? <laughs> mm -hmm. It's hard, isn't it? Especially when you're not supposed to touch your face, your eyes, your nose, your that mouth. Really hard. It is, but we have to try. Well, I mean, I'm glad that you are doing so well at this young age. But when you grow up, what would you want to be? Hmm. I want to be in a giant studio. Okay. With my lot of cameras. Wow, not just one. I can have one. <laughs> okay, mm -hmm. okay, two more. Uh -huh. Yes. And also, I can be given out free cameras too. Okay, so you want to give I out free I think you like cameras. to do free things, right? Would well, you want to teach other children how to take pictures? Yeah. Mm. Maybe so show us how you handle the camera. Show us what you do with the camera. I'm going to charge you for this picture though. <laughs> Since you like free things, I don't. Okay, let's pose. Okay. Mm. Nice. Mm. Mm. Do you like it? The lighting sounds really nice here. The lighting is not nice here. Yes. Yeah, okay. Mmm, too dark. Okay, so we should go so outside after the show. After yeah. the show, we we'll probably go out. for us. Yeah? <laughs> Free photo shoot, right? Hey. If that is what you that you'd be like, better view those people. <laughs> All right, so um, let's get back into um, what you're doing right now. Now, a lot of kids your age don't even understand what it means to have a handy work, like something they can do with their hands. A lot of them just wait for daddy and mommy, but already at a very young age, you have something that would probably put food on your table for the rest of your life. How do you feel about that? And what would be your advice to kids out there that do not even feel they have a reason to pick up a craft or the other? That's a mouthful, right? Listen, I know. do you understand that question? <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. So, okay. what would be your advice to children out there that mm. do not even understand the importance of learning one skill or the other? And never give up. Mm -hmm. Believe in yourself. And never listen to other people said. Never listen to other people that said you can never do it. Yeah. So did somebody tell you that you couldn't do this? Or that you're too young, or that why are you holding the camera? Did you have that? Yeah. Really? Did it hurt your feelings? Nah. Okay. You shook it off. I like this girl. That's good. Well, I wish you the very best with all of this. And I'm waiting for my picture. If not, <laughs> of course, we'll, we'll be having a photo shoot right after this, right? Yeah. But.